Let me now do the pleasant duty of declaring the ninth International Water Association Conference here in Vinduk as officially open. Situated in the middle of the driest country in sub-Saharan Africa, Vinduk has a long tradition of innovative water management that dates back to 1968, when the first water reclamation plant was built. With this in mind, the International Water Association saw it fit to host the conference here in Namibia. Another water reclamation plant was built in 2002, which is currently the only one that reclaims sewage water to potable drinking water. Additionally, the city is in the process of building a third reclamation plant that will treat industrial effluent to use it for irrigation purposes as well as sports fields in the city. The conference that is estimated to cost $4 million will run until Thursday. Water scientists will table issues pertaining to potable water, desalination, climate change and groundwater recharge. We will not know the value of water until the well runs dry. And in Namibia we can see it. Sometimes we pretend when there's a small flood coming, we get jittery forgetting that ours is a dry country. When the tap runs dry in your house is when you actually start to appreciate the value of water. Mutorua further said the streams of wastewater generated in our cities and towns should not be regarded as waste products, but rather as resources. Therefore, it is important to reuse water rather than import new water from distant locations. There are many professors here in the audience, PhD holders, experts with experience, attending this conference. I'm very pleased to learn that Namibia and Vinduk have raised the interests of our delegates and I urge all our local water professionals. Let us make optimum use of the amount of knowledge and expertise gathered in this place. I also urge our delegates to share freely your experiences and knowledge. The minister, alongside her worship, the mayor of the city of Vinduk, also opened the exhibition hall where various companies and research institutions will exhibit their technical expertise. The conference is expected to contribute to the local economy and boost the SME sector as over 400 delegates from different continents will be partaking in the conference. For the News on One, I am Rochelle Nadel.